Welcome to the course information video for Strata Fundamentals. The purpose of this video is to provide you with some information about the unique structure and requirements that you as a learner will have to complete for this course. We're also going to provide you with some technical tips as well as a bit of a navigation guide to help you progress through the course components as successfully as possible. Strata Fundamentals is the PDP program's first 12 credit blended course. So what do we mean by a blended course? In the case of Strata Fundamentals, it means that the course actually has three course components that you as a learner have to complete successfully before you will receive your 12 credits. You will not receive partial credit for only completing one component. The three components of Strata Fundamentals consist of an online course component, a bridging assignment, and a face-to-face -face classroom experience. The online component of the course is completed at revia.ca. Technical information about how to register and log into the course accompany this package for you. The online component of the course takes approximately six to nine hours to complete, depending on the learner. It contains a myriad of resources and information and building blocks of knowledge related to the Strata transaction and the role of the realtor in that transaction. At the end of the online course component, you will be required to download and work through what's called a bridging assignment. I won't give away any more details than that, but that assignment is clearly outlined for you towards the end of the online component. You will bring that bridging assignment with you to your face-to-face -face classroom component of the course. And at the beginning of the course, you'll be guided through a bit of an informal course quiz on the major elements that you should have already mastered by finishing the online component and the bridging assignment. The rest of your face-to-face -face course component will be filled with scenarios, and other building assignments off of the bridging assignment so that you can really feel you've had a chance to apply and practice the fundamentals of strata transactions that you learned about in the online component of the course. Please be aware that once you register and start to progress through the online component of the strata fundamentals course, there is no possibility for refund for that online component. You would be able to complete that online component and then hold that completion record for an indeterminate amount of time but if for whatever reason you do not complete the bridging assignment or are not able to attend the face-to-face -face course component, you would have to reschedule with your board and finish those components in order to receive your 12 credits. We know at first the blended format might seem a little bit confusing. It's unlike anything else that you've done in the PDP program to date. But what we do know with our course designers, with realtors and with managing brokers and other legal experts that we've talked to in the design of this course, we believe that by doing an online component that gives you fundamental knowledge building blocks, then complete a reflective assignment on your own, and then come to a face-to-face -face course section with a lawyer in Strata Transactions to really practice and apply allows you to really attain a level of understanding and comprehension around Strata Transactions that you need to successfully navigate those kinds of transactions in the marketplace. we'd like to provide you with some technical tips that will help you proceed through the online course component successfully. The online course component has been designed to be accessed by a laptop or desktop PC or Apple computer. Unfortunately, at this time, technical limitations do not allow for mobile access. You also need to have any pop-up blocker disabled on the browser that you're using to access the course. In order to access all the valuable readings, resources, and especially the bridging assignment, we need you to have a PDF reader or Acrobat reader installed on your computer in order to be able to access and open those documents successfully. Lastly, if you have clicked a link in the course to a resource or an activity or an outside resource and you're not seeing that resource pop up in front of your screen immediately, please minimize this course window and look for another browser window or tab that might have opened behind this course window. When you're done looking at the resource or proceeding through that element, then bring up this course window once again to proceed and navigate through the rest of the course component. Lastly, we'd like to give you a bit of a walkthrough on how to best navigate through the online component of the Strata Fundamentals course. When you first access the course, you'll notice that there's a title screen on the left-hand side, and on the right-hand side, a bit of a white strip that contains at the top a table of contents. The table of content links to each of the first screens of each lesson in the online component. So if you do want to jump between lessons, using the table of contents links allows you to do so easily. Once you're actually in one of the course lessons, the first screen that you'll see is actually a course index screen. That course index screen 
also acts as a way that you can jump between sections within that particular lesson. But if this is the first time that you're proceeding through the online component of Strata Fundamentals, we really recommend your best approach is to simply go through the course screen by screen using the linear navigation at the bottom center of each screen. At the end of each lesson, you will be required to click a check mark that certifies that you have completed the assignments and the readings and other course activities for each lesson. This certification or clicking activity is required in each lesson in order to trigger course completion. Towards the end of the conclusion lesson, you'll find the instructions and the downloads for the bridging assignment. You are required to at least download and save the instructions and all materials to your computer before pressing the completion confirmation for the concluding lesson. We hope you found this course information video informative and we look forward to seeing you all the way through the components of the Strata Fundamentals course.